Welcome to Bass and Bonsai. Today we're going bass fishing. It's only the second time we've been able to get out this year and we're down at the knob. We're going to get out here and see what we can catch. Can you see me? Should be an awesome day today. It's already about 10.30. It's a Sunday and as you guys will be find out real quick from uh, last year's videos, the water is way down to compared to what it was. The dam broke back open where the beavers had it blocked up and so it's gonna be a whole different fishing experience, I think, from what we had last year. So we're gonna get on the water and see what we can do. Wish me luck. Water, uh, water temp 63 degrees. It is almost 11 o'clock and the water you can probably make out is pretty stained so we'll probably use a little brighter baits just to start with and see where we need to go from there but there we go a little one but finally finally we're on the board and it is a bass down probably a little male a little quarter pounder with cheese but no skunk a lot of times it just helps you to get that first fish in the boat even if it's not a keeper size give you that extra confidence know that at least you got something that they will hit now the water's probably too dirty for it, but this is a time of year still for jerk baits to be good. And uh, I love throwing jerk baits with this rod. And this is uh, one of the new baits I haven't tried out yet. I got from my buddy Norm, painted up for me, Norm Coulter. So I'm just gonna throw it a little bit and see what happens down along this bank with the wind. Hopefully, and get a few to hit on it. And we got one. Good old jerk bait. better one oh yeah nice pound pound and a half maybe oh look at that good sharp hooks norm did replace most of the hooks for me these may be the ones that this one came with because I sent him a few new baits and a few old baits and he put new hooks on any of them that needed it You cannibalistic dog, you. Hate your little brother, didn't you? Nice bass. Eh, just over a pound, pound and a quarter. TRV, it's a good reel. It's kind of a shallow spool. Lightweight. It comes with the clicker already on it. For the drag so if you catch a fish that's what i like about it and it's got the red and gold accent colors just comes with a crazy handle i put the single lifestyle handle on it oh i thought i felt something i did feel something hitting at it little one I thought I felt something and he kind of wanted it and then he didn't. That's a good one. So, oh, you dog. Dirty dog. You guys didn't see that, did you? Can 
make out the post. That's where the old uh, dock used to be. There used to be a dock here, and we kept a John boat down here. Oh, and ooh, we catch a little quarter pounders with cheese down here. That's the old uh, McDonald's dock. That little guy. Mwah. Gotta love him. I'm liking this new rod so far. Pretty good for these shaky heads. Cast them right where I want them, pretty accurate. We'll see what it does when I get a few bigger fish on it. I caught the one first trip of the season. Works pretty good. There we go. Oh yeah. Works pretty good. Well, we may be on to something. You can see in no time at all, this worm picked up and does better than the other one. The pink one. Give him a kiss. Mwah. Now, sometimes I work this like a shaky head, and I'll just sit and shake it. Other times I just crawl along the bottom. I don't really have one set, you know, movement. I don't just use it strictly like shaky head and, you know, get it on the bottom and just wiggle it. I'll wiggle it i'll drag it sometimes i'll even you know just keep it moving if it's real gunky kind of like today and if you let it completely stop and set it may we go. you know sink and get all gunked up so i just kind of keep it moving trying to work it across the top of the bottom is what you want to do as slow as you can which sometimes with the gunk you can't go very slow so Come on. Mwah. Love you. So anyway, we seem to be onto something here. Which I don't know why, but usually this color, that pink, or just kind of this color or a green color without the bright color. Those three are about the only three colors you need on these shaky heads. And I don't know why sometimes the pink will by far outfish this one and some days this one is what they want i got something kids i'm not sure is that a crappie yep yeah, nice bass look at that cane tetan it's a nice little chunker i was just rigging them up getting ready to do a video to talk about these uh BFS reels and rods that I picked up off AliExpress. So I was just casting out a few times. I still haven't even rigged up the other rod yet. We're going to get this guy back in the water. Did we give him a kiss already? Nice little chunk. And would you look at that. Oh boy. A monster on the little Tomo. Well... I was going for crappie, but bigger. So, look at that hand. Let's get this little dog back in the water. Get bigger. Let's go back to our normally scheduled program. I got it from a source that I should try a spinner bait. Oh yeah, good source. There we go. Nice little chunk. Hang on a second, let me get a picture. So I can show. My source that they were right. Whoa. Mwah. Well, I got all ready to leave, and I just can't leave without playing around with the frog right in this section because there's just so much. 
opportunity here. I can't pass it up. I just got to try it like that. There. I just got to give it a try. <laughs> because I, something just told me that there's a bass wanting to hit top water today. And there he is. See that frog had him good bottom lip, but it'll work. Mwah. Love you. Love you, topwater bass. I don't care what size you are. Whoa, we got nasty. Clean a frog up. He's always peeing on me. You guys ever had a frog pee on you? All right, everybody. I'm going to put a wrap on this video. Hope you liked it. Uh, we did catch quite a few. Caught uh, one on the topwater right at the end there. But that was all that was working. I'm going to finish getting the boat out. Get on out of here. I don't know how many crappie if they've caught very many down there. But like uh, once again the water is way down from what it was normally. And all this mossy stuff kind of created some issues for us throughout the day. And the wind of course as the wind will do to you. But if you like this video hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. A lot more fishing videos coming and bonsai videos all the time also so help share this channel too we were over 3,000 subscribers thank you very much if you're subscribed to the channel uh what else donald trump are you watching somebody tell donald trump about this thing all right guys like always thanks for watching oh my God. Woo! Yeah.